hilarious. Hello? Oh, he's my officer. Oh, no. Oh, no, bro. Nah. 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 Pick the clip up. What's up with you, game? Nah, hold on. All right, all right. Hey, OG. Hey, OG. My fault, game. Hold on. What's poppin' YouTube? It's your boy Kais here with my lovely wife. It's just Alex. What's up, people? We're back. Part two of the Walking Dead playthrough. We're gonna continue where we left off. As you guys see, I just made a compilation catch-up so you guys can see what happened in the last episode. So now we need to try to figure out how we can get into this pharmacy, get the keys. And we just found out Lee's brother and his family, they, they got packed the up, man. They took the L. So we're gonna jump straight into it. No more talking. All right, y'all. Also, we're gonna do a long playthrough because you guys did a poll. You guys said you guys like the hour plus videos. You guys don't want 30 minute videos. Shout out to the guy who did suggest it. I thank you for looking out, but the people spoke. They want what they want. Let's do it. Okay, so what we left off with, we already talked to him, right? Mm. How we doing? Good. Wanna go have a look around outside? Not now. All right. Yeah. Okay. So we already looked. We already took the look around. We found out that that wasn't. Talk to Carly. So they just want us to go straight into it, huh? Central High Tech State. Papers a week old. Feels like years. Yeah. You ready to head out? You got it. You? Shoot. Yeah. Let's do it. Let's go. Hey. Because we gotta go save that uh, old boy, right? Yeah. Yeah. Shit. Get down! Not in the Letterman jacket. Oh. He must have been a high school student. My boy Pat, my boy was like, Syracuse! <laughs> Syracuse! <laughs> We're going state! <laughs> did you see that? I sure did. Be ready to shoot. Guys! Oh, man. I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn. All right, that wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. Oh, no Lord. Way. We gotta go now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas, and then up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her, and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't, and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A couple almost got me. And I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Yes, Damn we can. Right you, can. you guys are suicidal. I didn't even get a I'm saving her. With or without you. Think about it if it was You just had to get saved. Fine. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. I don't agree with saving her, bro. I don't either. You talking Dang. about she You talking about she was screaming. Now if she shoots them, she's gonna draw too much attention. Yeah, I don't know about this one. This one ain't the call, buddy. Okay, this is the plan. We don't know how hard it's gonna be to get her out of that room. Yeah, it's boarded up. So we have to kill every one of them in here. Quietly. Noise attracts these things. Now let's have a look around. Oh my gosh, bro. Oh, man. 
Oh nah, this game right there, close. If I peek too long. Yep. There's one back there trying to get into a room. But oh I didn't gosh, see anyone actually game. in there. Oh my gosh, game. Oh. All right, I'm a. I'm thinking we can get to that truck, huh? And then get to that fat dude and get that axe. We can hide by that RV if we're quiet and keep our heads down. But then that truck. Truck or RV, what are we doing? Well, if the RV has the uh has a is a, has an axe over there, cause how you gonna kill him quietly without her shooting them? Ah, this game is so tough. Look how aggro that that thing is. All right, hold on. What is this? There's a pillow over there. That's about as far as I got when it came to supply gathering. I might have an idea for it. Oh. Shoot him with the pillow. Good luck smothering them to death. That's not really what I have in mind. Okay, okay, okay. Use the pillow to uh shoot him with. Okay. Right, let's do it. Let's do it. We go RV grab it. Shit. Oh. oh the noises sound nasty. Well, I got one pillow and two corpses. An age old problem. How are we supposed to kill? problem so we can't even do it that world okay why'd you have me come over if I couldn't kill him I guess we gotta do the truck road because I only got a pillow it's not gonna pop up I didn't it got my dog Greg laid out man not Greg I wonder if there's anything in the pickup Oh my gosh. A pillow's not gonna break a window. You need to find a weapon. Let's keep looking around. Keep looking around. He's still alive too. We could do something with that car, I bet. If it weren't for that fellow lurking near the front. Alright. Oh, I'm probably gonna have to. Bro, a pillow is devious work for a weapon, bro. I'm not even gonna count with you. And breaking that window is stupid work. Yeah. Okay, so no matter if I no matter what direction I press, it's gonna go back over here. Okay. Alright, I say we pillow, we pillow party. The bumper sticker is the funniest crap. Alright. <laughs> Get out your gun. But the yeah. noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. It's a pillow. It's a pet. It's a pillow pet. Damn. Yep. Yep. That was sick. Shut the freak up. Okay, steep. She's still over there grubbing. Uh, 
unlock gear shifts. They really want to get into that room. Is there anything else I can use? I know if I gear shift it, it's going Spark plug. You should hold on to that. Be coming handy. Because now, if you push the car, it's just gonna go. Ooh. He said, "What's up, y'all? How y'all doing on this body?" Ooh. That was awesome. <laughs> Steve, you good? Man, Steve, Steve, all right. Steve, all right. The thing is now we don't got the pillow no more. Yeah. Eesh. I don't know. Spark what they gonna do? Let me see the spark plug. The porcelain inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper. Greg, you good down there? Oh, he good. Bro, is it worth saving this chick, bro? Let's oh, keep no. it a bam. Let's keep it a slam bam. Thank you, ma'am. Grandma Gemma, that it's not working. Brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. All right. Well, I'm Crocodile Dundee with it. I'm AI with the braids. About to go stupid with this screwdriver. Man. Let's do it. 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 Go over here. Meow, meow, meow. AI with the braids. Oh, they gonna make me do it? Oh. Oh. No, no way y'all made me do a command prompt just to stab this man. Oh, oh. Get what? Off me. you had what? Get this it. Minky, get off me! Nice. nice. Thanks for having my back. For sure. Where did he get the plank of wood? Ciao. Hey, bro. Nah, bro, we Nah, we don't. It went straight through his head. Dude, where'd your weapon go? Into that ice big sized hole. <laughs> Holy shit. It's cool. Now we've got this. Are you yeah. two done? Nope. Oh. We could have been back at the pharmacy. Yes, sir. Two more. That should help. One too many. Oh, they gonna make me. Alright. Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay, we'll be right behind you. They gonna make me solo dolo this? Oh, nah. She can't even shoot him. It's I'm about to be a firefighter. Noise. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's do it, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. Hello? Miska! Oh! He said, what you do to my girl? That's Freddy! That's Freddy! Oh, stop! Ow. God damn! Keep the axe. Oh, you better uh, come out this room, too. Hello in there. We're here to help. Please just go away. Let's go, guys. In a minute. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. Please. She's in trouble. No. Miss, we're coming in. Huh. Nah, bro, just talk to her, bro. You might want to break through that board first. Bro, what if she got a Glock? Bro, why are we doing this? She don't want to be saved. Because him. Because he want to be a captain to save everybody. But he had to get saved by the motel. She don't want to be saved. Don't save her. Stop. Just stop. I'm 
coming out. You want to come out because somebody kicking on the door. What the fruit? Oh God. I, I said stay away. We need to get you help. It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? I told you, I said go away. I'm bit. But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? Man. What I the don't fuck is wrong with him? Hey, yo! <sighs> Bro, she's dying, man. What the freak going on? <clears throat> Next time, Glenn, 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 Glenn. Please, just leave me. Please go. Okay, no, we'll leave. Bye. Okay, we'll leave. Just. Try to take care of yourself for whatever time you have left. You have a gun. So? Can I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? Give it to me. I can just, you know, end this and then, and then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're <laughs> satanic. Well, suicide. We can't let you do that to yourself. Then do it for me! We need to get going. Give it to me, please! This is crazy! Please, step back. It's just two seconds, just one bullet, and I can be with my family, and it'll all be fine. Miss. Back up! Please! Oh, dang. Oh, dang. Wait a minute! Whoa. Oh! Ah! Can't file an insurance claim on that. <sighs> Can't sue or nothing. Really? Really? All right, let's do it. My freaking gosh. <sighs> Whoa, take it easy. We just want to help. You can't. Miss, just relax now. You need to think this through. We'll find you a doctor. It'll be okay. Let's all just... Oh, no, no, no! Oh my gosh, she just alerted the whole... Yep. Yep. This is your fault. Yeah. This yeah. is your fault. This is your fault. This is your fault. Let's get out of here. Here they come. Now we gotta run. Shit! Here they come! Oh my gosh, bro. All because get you in. wanted a female, bro? Ooh! What did you get a whip? All that for for a chick that was Everyone just going... Right? Bro, that was not yeah, worth we it. we had some close calls, but... Glenn is fine and, well, yeah, we're okay. I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. Well, we got an axe now. What yeah. do we really need? Clementine. Clement dog, what's up with you, bruh? Cause th these man, these people out here tripping. How's your finger, Clem? Good. It doesn't hurt so much anymore. Good. I know I'm not your dad, but if you need anything, I'm your guy, okay? Okay. Same. You're my guy? Oh, no. Do you know... <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna try to take care of each other. Yes. Deal. Let me know if you need anything. Okay. Now I need to go talk to Glenn, because I know he's shooking up. I can't believe she did it How to her, so. Glenn? You know. This, I don't know why he thought. Do you know the combination for the lock on the gate outside? Why? 
Oh, you know, I thought I'd go stretch my legs. You're probably better off breaking it if you have to. Back to the motor in. How can it be that bad so fast? You know, when things are taken away, people do crazy shit. Dang, you're not thinking, That's bro. not me. I'm not giving up. Not for anything. I respect Good. it, but that was Good. stupid, bro. I guess you really wanted that gun. Seems like. Why didn't you tell Carly to just give it to her? Would you? People can't be given up. You? This will pass. I'm with you. I'm glad to hear it. What's your next move? I don't know. I mean, you guys seem okay. What nah, bro, family? you can't roll with us, yeah, bro. Yeah, I... I... Forget it, man. That's your business. I hate feeling like I can't do anything. I know the feeling. Stop right. doing dumb things, Glenn! Try to get some rest. <laughs> yeah, right. Hey, bro, have a candy bar. Found some snacks. I'm cool. Not much of an appetite. Maybe save it for one of the kids? Alright, cool. So, so he already said it. Give it to the kids, bro. So, Duck, I know you hungry, gang. Here, bro. It's not much, but here. For the boy. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates. Yes, sir. That's sweet, Lee. Hey, one thing is, we know Kenny, Kenny, Kenny bought it. We yeah. need, we need Kenny, bro. All right. All right. All right. He so, gonna break. He gonna break the combination with the uh. With the, the axe. axe. Yeah. Problem with that is. If, oh yeah, because if I break the if I break it with the axe, I can get the pharmacy key. Okay. Okay. Let's go How outside, Doug. Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Yes, sir. Let's have a look around. Okay. Yes, sir. I would have tried to knock down the door. Oh. With the axe. You think we can if do it? it? If, I don't think we can, though. Is the TV on? Yep. Awesome. Now to distract those things. Carefully. Where the brick at? I can't reach that brick. What the freak? Open the gate! Open the gate, you thug. <clears throat> I'm AI with the brakes. Sir. Miska, Muska, Mickey, Mickey, Mouse, Mouse. Mickey. Yes, sir. They said, "Hey, the game on." Syracuse, stupid. <laughs> Syracuse. <laughs> Now's the time. Yeah. Hey, hurry up and go. Hey, bro. Be careful. Keep an eye out, will you? Stop talking to me, gang. Somebody saw me. Hey, bud. Bro, what you talking to him for, bro? He I don't know what happened to mom and dad, but I know if you were there, you would have died for them. So, uh, yeah. I'm gonna assume that's what happened. Did you find them yet? Give me a second. The freak you yelling for? Is everybody just stupid in this apocalypse? I got to do this now, man. I ain't got no talking, bro. Do this. That's a feather. Bro, ain't no, ain't no talking. Bro. Ain't no talking, bro. Ain't no talking, bro. He gone, bro. Oh, here he go. Here he go. Dang, this game is cruel. Why you got me? Nah, bro. He not. Come on, bro. God dang. Dang. That's brutal. I need, I need the keys, bro. God.
There we go. Holy crap! Run! Why would you yell? I'm so sick and tired of people being stupid. And he dropped the axe. And now, now the gate's broken. Yep. Man, that was close. But we did it. It's all that matters. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Let's get in there. Shut up. Bro, he couldn't even give the, the brother a peaceful chop, bro. He had to chop him like eight times. What's up with you, Shawty? She shook. Oh, I could have broke the door down. Mm. <laughs> nah, that wasn't. That wasn't what I was trying to do. Oh no. We gotta hurry. Set off the alarm. Set off the freaking alarm. What a key. Oh, oh the back alley. Who's in my store? Oh, his his mom. Think that's the mom? Or something. Time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up round back. Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly dallying. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. Guys, that door's not locked anymore. Well, I ain't got Shit. no. You three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. Stay away from the windows. Glad we need your help. Hey, Lee. If we don't make it through this, you should know that I think you're a great guy. We will make it through this. Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should know. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Nigga. Oh. I should know what? Huh? You said I should know. Shit. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. Are you sure? Oh, shit. What? Oh, shit. Oh. Okay, then. Come in time. Can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Okay. Oh, my gosh, bro. Did you find anything? Nothing. Wait. Okay. The window is screwed. Go. Y'all not, 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 not getting in nothing. I found something. Oh, oh my dad's key. Give me that. Dad is dead, bro. It's okay. Dad is dead. Get off me. Oh, no. Get off me. Get off me. Get off me. Oh. Okay. Dang. No, you got to save Carly. But Doug. Nope, Doug gotta a save real Carly. One. But Doug's a real one. You gotta save Carly. She the one with the Glock. Oh my gosh, bro. No! Get him off of me! Ah! 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 Doug! Ah! Doug! Doug was a liability more than an asset. He was a liability? Yep. Is that how we play in this? Yep. We gotta play it smart. Finally got the Glock. What are we supposed to do? <sighs> what are we supposed to do? All right. No, you're right. She do got the Glock, bro. 
R.I.P. Doug, bro. You was a real one, bro. Oh my God. Let's go. They got Doug. Oh they, no! They, you gotta move. Get off. Get off of her. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with folks? What's wrong with Buddy? You son of a bitch! No! What? What the heck? What? Uh, 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 oh, I'm, I'm about, about to say. Get today. Let's go, Kitty. Especially you my dog. Good friend. <laughs> you my dog, Kitty. Nah, the daddy needs to go. Yeah, I'm, I'm smoking him. Yeah, it's over. That's it's it. over for that's pops. Done. It's over for pops. I gave you medicine, and this is how you repay me? Oh, nah, it's bro. over for you, big dog. It's over for you. It's over for you, buddy. I don't give a crap what you got to say to me now. You got one time to betray me in this apocalypse, and I'm cut. I'm cutting your fingers off. It's over. Nah, bro. Oh, the chick. Oh man, Clementine. Nah, bro, it's 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 it's, it's clips for the dad, bro. Somebody in there fighting. If I left you alone for five minutes, I don't know how hard it is to keep track of things. That's all being loud. I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds Glenn, like nobody knows what's she happening. Come. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Everything we own would be lost if I left you alone for five minutes. I don't know how hard it is to keep track of things. It's not like we have much to begin with. Your dad tried to kill me, bro. I really don't. I really don't care for you. I think it's the wrong call. I think you're making the wrong call. Maybe. But I'd rather make the wrong call and no than make the right call and not. I what? That. You guys be safe. We'll try. Who are you gonna help? Because you couldn't even help her. Glenn, bro. Oh, I, I know you ain't back there. Oh, I got some beef for you. Ooh. Oh, old, oh, old, oh, old. Oh, 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 I got beef. I got beef. Hey, kid. Oh, you lucky I got to talk to Close Kitty Kurt. back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, Kenny, you my dog. Do. You solid. Hey, about Clementine. Yeah? Earlier, I said there's some stuff out there that might screw up a precious little girl like her. You did. Well, I still think that's true. But after what I saw today, I think between you taking care of her and her taking care of herself, you two are going to be just fine. Hey, you my dog, Kitty. <laughs> you got it. You my dog, Kitty. Hey, no matter what, I'm side with Kitty. That's just for now. That's He earned my respect, bro. That loyalty is I all I care about is loyalty in this world at this point. Carly, you a solid one too. You my A one day one too. How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do. Yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met, and he was such a. It's just that I think that I liked him. Oh. Well, I'm sure he liked you, too. <laughs> you better have. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. 
Wait, Lee? Everything we own would be lost if I what left you it? alone for five minutes. How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. I was going to help you both, but... I was going to help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? I wish too. Me too, Carly. Because Glenn left, so now we lost the man. Yeah. If I would have known, I wish it would have been Glenn back there. Be quiet. I lost my dog for no reason. Talking her ear off. Oh, not man, even knowing she don't feel like out. talking. The Dumatron had this minigun on his shoulder. Oh, I got... I, oh, it's, it's up for you. It's up for you. Wait till I get an opportunity, buddy. He wasn't. Oh, and then... Hey, Duck, uh, you want to cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. I'm sorry there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's... I got grabbed again. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn oh. had the other one. Ah! Uh, it's just a walkie-talkie. It probably wasn't much use to begin with. It wasn't just a walkie-talkie. I know it doesn't that. make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. Oh, I did. That was... Yeah. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee. Come here for a second. Nah, mm. you. Let me go deal with this. Ooh, I, I, oh, I. Oh, man. Let me. Clementine, another thing. What do you want? You like my daughter? What? No! Not really. Nobody want her. Her dad tried to kill me, so. Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. And so will everyone else if you go near her. You hear me? I know who you are, oh, and I don't give a shit about what happens to you, but if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Why was there no option for me to just... Do you have a second? No! My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. The guy does is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. We're lucky to have you. What is up this music? Somebody poppy. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. They're worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Not with, not with OG. Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Somebody didn't pay the light bill? That's not. Dang. That's Edison for you. Oh, we finished chapter one. Let's go. Oh, well. Let's go. But well, we doing chapter two now. Oh, wait, y'all laid up. It would be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy, I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. You fuck with us! Now we're gonna take what we want! There's too many of them! Yeah! Oh, what's going on? What's going on? You never liked my dad. Even back at the drugstore when everyone thought Kenny's kid was you went out of your way to side against him. This isn't happening. Oh! Hey, I'm a oh, please. No more, please. We're happy. Please, please. Uh. Oh! But well, we going straight into it. We going straight into oh. it. Wait a minute. Okay. We lied to Herschel. 
You and 54% fit, were honest. Okay. So I was told the truth. Yeah. 52% chose Duck. Loyalty with Kenny. 54% chose Kenny. Yes, sir. Gave Irene the gun. You and 53% of the players refused to give her the gun. Okay. Who would you save? Doug or Carly? So majority of people saved Doug. Really? So we we chose a different route. I'm going to let y'all know, hey, man, if I get a chance, if OG keep talking the way he talking, bro, he ain't going to make it past <laughs> this. He ain't making it past this episode. I promise you. He's not making it past this episode. He got one more time to put his hands oh. on me, bro. On the walking dead. I know who you are. Oh, I got shit. another good one for you. <laughs> That blew me. All by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. Clementine A1, Keep an eye on that A1. front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. RP Doug. You got it. That's my and dog. I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. You got it, boss. <laughs> Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. It's, it's up we for him, in with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. Oh my god. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. He wasn't worried about Duck. Tell you, you be cooking, man. Y'all cooking. Because, shoot, I ain't never wanted to fight an old person so much in my life, bro. It's crazy. Y'all like, really changed me for real. Like, this, this is a, a life changing real. experience. Whoa. Already. We in it. Miska! Dang. He said totally. <laughs> Dang, it's been three months. He was just trying to veg out. Who the freak are you? What'd they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well, that's another meal lost. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. A uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. Mark? We're all hungry. No kidding. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was going to take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Mark? Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. We'll manage. Maybe. You know, some people aren't too happy about the way Lily's handling rations. Lily knows it's important to keep the adults Lily? functioning. Sometimes that means someone's got to miss a meal. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense. I don't right know who on. Lily is, but Kenny, you know, my day Kenny's one. Been talking about uh, I think off Lily's the daughter. RV running. Oh, is it? Yeah. Kenny won't abandon us. He's a good man. Yeah, I guess we'll see. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal anyway? Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. Mm -hmm. He's just uh, looking out for his daughter. Hey, I know Lily. She can take care of herself. He needs to take that energy and put it towards finding us some more food. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me Bro. flat. Why are you bringing up old stuff? Nah, it's beef. I just need... I, I kindle the beef. That's all, <laughs> that's all we need to know. Ooh, get the crow. Get the crow. Oh, 
Better not miss, neither. It's a long shot. I'd hate to waste the bullets. Trust me. If I don't think I can hit it, I won't shoot. Oh, you! Shit, was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on! And he missed, bro. He's trash with the gun. He's unreliable. Okay, Mark is now unreliable. Now we're gonna have to save Kenny. Kenny better not be in danger, bro. Jesus Christ. Oh, shit. No, no. Please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher. We'll leave. Sir, please. You guys okay? Get, get it off. Get it off. God damn it. Get, get it off me. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp, and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? It's okay. We're not gonna hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, just let us go. We're not uh, a threat to you. You can't chill out. We'll try yeah, to help no you, but you gotta shut the fuck up. Yeah, talk your talk, up. Kitty. You gotta help us. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad you was shut special up. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you You're can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. Shaggy? Was he bitten? Bitten? No, I swear! Hurry, please, hurry! Lee, this trap's been altered. There's no release latch. Oh no. Because he was doing all that streaming. Yep. Walkers! It's now or never, Lee. Please! Get me out of the. Kenny, keep those walkers off of me! Is what is happening to Just us? Get me out, please. please do stop blood and screaming. We're gonna be surrounded any minute. Please, get me please out get of me this. Me. Try to cut the chain. Oh God! Oh God! Oh God. Hurry! Uh, There's uh, so much blood already. Let's go, please let's hurry go. up. Uh, forget it. We use chain like that at the airport. Please to lift please. order. Just Come leave on, and not cut through this. Try something. Lee, it has to be now. Please hey, hurry. Bro. Your leg you gone, cuz. You your leg. Your leg's gone, cuz. You gotta cut your leg. Gonna have to cut you out. Damn it, no, no, just no. cut off his fucking leg. Try the trap again. We don't Get have time for please. that. I'm sorry, but we have to go now. <laughs> ah. <laughs> <laughs> Can't keep him back forever. I'm sorry, gang. <laughs> you wanna live, right? Dang. Oh God, there's so many of them. I'm just wasting ammo now. We gotta go. I'm sorry, gang. Uh, oh God. Shit. Is he? He passed out. Hey, what the freak happened to the leg? If he's alive, grab him and let's go. Hey. Okay, Mark. Behind you! Travis! Come on, come on, we gotta move! Ah! Run! What you? Oh my oh, gosh! Travis, ah! Travis, Travis is dead. Travis is dead. Travis is dead. Travis is dead. No! Travis, you're trash. I'm sorry, bro. You gotta. You, you're trash, buddy. You're dead! You're dead! You're dead! You're done! Syracuse! <laughs> Zombies can't bite me. I'm going to state. <laughs> I'm going to CIS. I'm going to CIS. I'm going to regionals, dude. Are you? Dude, okay. my dad. My dad was not only the Brad. He was the Brad that went to Syracuse. <laughs> All right, we gotta stop. Right. People like, what's wrong with y'all? Dang. Hey, man. Making all that noise.
Bro. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? Come on! Come oh on! Oh my god! What happened? Oh, what the hell? What's going on? We don't have time to explain. Lee, are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken. Lee! I, I don't know. Lee! What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking minute? We would have died if we left him. So what? We are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group. Right here, right now. Well, what hang on. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine. You guys fight it out then. <sighs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come yeah. over here and see what I drew. Wait, what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, it. but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. Kenny's right. Yep. Yeah, you're in charge of I'm the, with the schedules, but you're not in charge of people's lives. Really? You weren't there. Lee made a choice. End of story. Look, once Katja patches that guy up, you can kick him out of here. Send him out on their own. I couldn't care less. But they at least deserve a fighting chance against the walkers. And for the record, Kenny wanted to leave those people behind. If Kenny would pull his head out of his ass for five seconds, he'd mm. realize that I make these decisions to protect his family. We simply don't have enough food. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. I'll really, I'll really, I'll really kill you, Pops. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? I'll really kill you, Pops. Like... Ooh, man, I, if I catch you, when I catch you, I when I catch you, Larry, you stay on and lost the weight. If you think I'm weight. doing such a shitty job, question. then you do it. You smuggling food. That's all the food we have for today. You decide who gets to eat. Wait, no, I'm serious. Pick up that food and start handing it out. You see how it feels to not have enough food for everyone. All right, shoot. Guess who I'm going to feed? Not you. Cause I still got energy bars. Yes, sir. So you think? Well, I ain't got no obligation to Syracuse, so he not eating. Give it to the kids. How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. I'm feeding Clementine. I don't give a crap. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. Give her a piece of jerky. Okay. A Sunday would be better next time. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. I'm sorry, if bro. You have any more food? Do I gotta Duck feed is Duck? Too. Yeah. Why don't we need to get some food? 
Happy duck. Hey, duck. How about a little food? Here. Yeah! Oh man, I'm so hungry! I'm feeding my day one Carly, though. Oh, but the. Wait, 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 wait. She's taking care of everybody. I'm sure Kenny. Kenny would rather I feed his family. Yeah. Than. So they they both parents, they understand if I don't feed I already fed their kid. Kenny, what's up with you, bro? Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. Mm. It's probably our best bet. Look, you've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters, and you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. Living like Larry! You and Clem are welcome to come with us. Nah, we leave does sound like a smart idea. Maybe that is the best thing. I know that it is. I'm taking my family. Yeah, bro. Freaking, I side with Kenny day one ish, bro. <laughs> I don't give a crap. Oh, I gotta wear her over though. Sleeping any better? No. I know we should be grateful for beds, but no, I'm not. Drugstore? Yeah. She got PTSD. Mm -hmm. Lily has me handing out the food. Ugh, that can't be an easy job. It's not. I won't be able to feed everyone. What should I do? Well, if you wanted to get in good with Lily, I'd make sure Larry gets some food, even though that guy can be a real dick sometimes. On the other hand, giving that food to Kenny and his family might make him remember you, if he decides to take off in that RV one day. What about you? You need food, too. We all need food. I can't tell you what to do, but whatever happens, I know you'll be trying to do the right thing. Thanks, Carmen. I don't care for Mark. I don't care for Larry. I don't care for Lily. You know who I care for? It's a Ken uh, Carly and Kenny. Want that's something that's to it. Eat? Give half an apple. Have an apple, Carly. God, I used to eat an apple every morning with some granola and six almonds, and that wasn't enough even then. But you know what? Yes. And I'm feeding Kenny wife. Uh, some of these people have gone longer than me without food. No. They're the ones that need it. We never, we never, we never selfishly eat because we'll find opportunity. I'm feeding Kenny wife. Because even if I don't feed Kenny, it's going to go a long way. Here, mm -hmm. eat something. <sighs> Why don't you give it to Doc? I'm a little busy with your mess right now. Is he going to be okay? I don't know. Can you give me a hand real quick? Sure. What do you need? Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this, sewing up people's injuries. But I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but Lee, this man has no leg. I did the right thing. Yeah, I know you did. I'm not gonna blame your the husband. It's just scary sometimes, I guess. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check in on the others. I need a little space here anyway. So she don't want the food. At least I tried. So guess who finna eat? Kenny Boss. Kenny, you finna eat? Baby. Want something to eat? Here, Kenny. Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Yeah, I gave him something. Sure, then hand it over. I'm starved. Thanks. The others notice you fed Kenny. Guess what? I don't give a crap how y'all feel. It's Kenny till I die. Not such an easy job, is it? I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Hey, thanks for looking out for me and my family. I'm serious about that offer to come with us. You've more than earned a ride on the RV with me. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. Give a crap You're about out. 
What happened to my food? There's none left. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk, old man. Yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. There's so much beef in this group. And you know what? You know what? I don't care. Because Larry, hey, is Larry aren't going to make it. I don't know, but Kaja will do her best. I promise. I thought that Can't was your teacher. Off his leg. There was no other way. How you holding up, kid? Uh, well, I, um, uh, I keep wondering if I could have done something to help, you know? Some kind of, I don't know, something. You'll be prepared next time. Next time? Yeah. So who are you people? Our group's gonna wanna know. I'm Ben. Ben Paul. Ben the man Paul? you saved is Mr. Parker. The band director at my school. Oh, the band down from Stone Mountain for the playoffs when, when is. everything happened. Relax. We'll get your friend back to normal in no time. I sure hope so. You're not worried about eating right now. I fed who I needed to feed. Suck. Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Oh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. Oh my goodness. Nah, bro. Hey, you holding up okay, Lee? I was pretty fucked up back there. Having to cut that guy's leg off. Yeah, I just hope Kaja can save him. You ever miss the Air Force Base? I mean, this wall isn't exactly military standard. No way I'm going back there. You saw what it was like when you guys picked me up. Completely overrun. It's Lily's pretty pissed at us. Listen, I know her intentions are good, but... But nothing! She's making the smart choice. Those parasites you guys brought back need to go. I'm so tired. Hey, I'm tired. I'm really, I'm really... Sorry, there's, there just wasn't enough food to go around. I understand. Gotta be hard to make those decisions. Just get me next time. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. Nah. Give it to Mark. I don't trust Mark, you. this should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? Nope. Come oh. on, Larry. Cut Lee some slack. He knows you're just out to protect Lily. He told me so. Just like he's trying to protect Clementine. He... Oh, I just need some food. Going this long without a proper meal make anybody... Cry. Nah, you've been like this since day ben, one. Lee, come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing... Let him go, Let him go Katja. But... He just needs time. It's been a rough morning. Hey, man. That man you brought, I tried, but he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? What the? What the? What the? Get the? Get the? How did you become? Get the? Wait a minute. Too busy. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh! Move, move! Shit! It's How'd so you miss? You missed the crow, and then you missed the whole head. Bro, bro, freak off. bro! Freak off! Kill him, Mark! Understand okay? how he became a yeah. walker Thanks. if he got caught in a bear trap. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed. You said he wasn't bitten. What? 
We asked you point blank, was he bitten, and you said no! He wasn't! Well, your not-bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What?! Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. You don't need to be bit to turn. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. God help us. It makes sense. In those first few days, it spread so fast. Yeah, because now everybody got bit. Yeah. Suicides. Everything was making more of them. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God... Back off! Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we we just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off! Carly. Are you armed? Yeah. F for protection. Dead could be anywhere. But, uh, no, I think you got the upper hand here. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. It's too good to be true. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. So, uh, what are y'all thinking? What you think? We gotta go get food. Everybody hungry. You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. We need food, but... Yeah. So, this dairy, you guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. It's nice Sango to get away Papa. from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. Nah, it's Kenny. Kenny keep us motivated, bro. I'm... He believes Kenny, my dog knows how important it is for us not to give that up. I can't fault him for that. Or maybe you just don't want to be in charge. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Larry. Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine might know. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I lied to her, but... Somehow, what exactly did happen with the senator? It was an accident. I mean, I, I pretty much knew about the affair. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Mm, sure it's gonna come. It's gonna keep coming up, though. Yeah. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years, I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I, uh, I really appreciate that. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? Move around a lot. I None move of your around freaking... a lot. Hard to call business. any place home, I guess. I used to move around a bit myself, but the dairy will always be home to me. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? We work as a group. All of us looking out for each other. I hear that. Cause they go. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? See you later. Enough to defend ourselves. Enough to defend ourselves. Well, that's good. It's getting dangerous out there. Well, you guys know. 
Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember. I don't trust them. I don't trust them either. You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always Fucking pumping this shit. Bandits. Who? Those look like the people Calm who raided down. my camp. Who oh, are they? Shh. Fuck you. Fucking you knew we were hungry. And you guys were keeping it there's all for yourself. Oh, no. There's yeah, and you know what? Moral. We ate it all. What are you going to fucking do about it? Don't worry. Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out and hope they move on. Fuck you! Oh! Don't shoot Fuck if you're not you. Jesus. Asshole. The world out here has gone to shit. Come on. Let's get to the dairy where it's safe. I'll take that crossbow. Yeah. Y'all gonna leave a perfectly good crossbow, huh? We gotta remember their names, cause he said you, you and Gary, Andy, Andy and G who? Oh, he said Gary. Yeah, okay. he said Gary. If we hear anybody Gary named King. Gary, it's up. St. John Family Dairy. <laughs> Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out. <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing four thousand volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. Hmm. Ever have any accidents? Nah. It's safer here than out there. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He moves around a lot, but things the way they are, maybe we can convince him to stick around for a while. Why you just introduce me? We got a few more me? friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? We work together. We all work together. Plus, we've got plenty of people with military experience. Well, that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Now that y'all are here, we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. You gasoline? We're awful hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's mm. right. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What's she? We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. Mark, you're speaking vet? out of turn. Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! <laughs> Maybe our whole group could come. For the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out. Nah, this too good. Nah, no. this too good to be true. Why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Oh. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. Nah, this nah. place is you're not incredible. Use me as, it's got uh, food. Walker bait. That fence? Oh, man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, 
We need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Obviously they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking the fence perimeter? Sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. Alright, I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. through a lot of wood keeping those fences repaired. If a couple of tools out in the open is as unsafe as it gets, we'll be fine here. Nah, Would have been bro. nice to have one of these back at the motor end. Nah, Looks like the fence runs around the entire property, not just the house. Hmm. Yep, can't take any chances when it comes to safety. Nah, y'all too, y'all too good to be true. Nah, this like, this some like Resident Evil type energy, bro. Y'all way too good, bro. I don't trust none of y'all. It's like that. It's like when a grandma, or you see a random grandma that says, themselves. that come out, let's talk about some. I got y'all a pie. Never eat the pie, bro. <laughs> you never eat the pie. So what have you found out? Is this looking like a good place to stay? I'll keep looking around. All right. Keep me nah, posted. I need, to, I need to look more, bro. I, I, that wasn't a good look. He said that wasn't a look good look. He's over there. Oh, it's a swing. Nah, bro. We don't trust nobody. I just don't want Larry. I don't want Larry coming with us. Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. How'd it break? Got busted the first day those things showed up. Thank God no one was on it at the time. Looks like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. I ain't worried about no swing set. What's wrong with you? Hold on, bro. You know what I gotta go to? I gotta go check that, that farm field. Hmm. You know what's up with y'all? Y'all, y'all living, y'all living pretty comfortable out here. Hey, uh, what are you fixing to do around the barn? Just trying to find more ways to help out. Well, I appreciate that. Tell you what, we'll find you something to do over there after we get back from securing the perimeter. Nah, they got, they got something in that barn. They got something in that barn. They got something in that barn. Nah. This dairy won a lot of ribbons in its day, huh? This place was my daddy's life. Meant everything to him. You know, when he first bought this place, I it ain't was know. a single nah, story. You ain't got, you ain't got no more uh, times right? you be following After behind me. After us kids was born, he insisted on adding a second floor. He said they had to have room for as many babies as they could have. <laughs> Mama, she was done after Dan. My Damn. folks stopped after two as well. Then one day, the world changed. Now this place is all we have left to daddy. That's why we take such good care of it, and why we want to share it with good folks like yourselves. Okay. Nah, you can't believe dudes like this, bruh. Nah, it ain't safe to be here. It ain't safe. This rope is perfect for the swing. What about this swing set, bro? I don't give a crap about this swing. I guess this is where they gonna end up. Mmm, fresh herbs. I can hardly wait for dinner. I'm worried about herbs, bruh. Herbs and spices. Should I fix the swing set? Yeah. Might as well. Mind if I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? 
I like a guy who takes some initiative. Yeah, go right ahead. You just stuck that in your back pocket? <laughs> you got deep pockets. Hey man, his money long. <laughs> really got me out here fixing a swing set, bro. Like, like I people think they're gonna end up here, but I don't think it's smart because some, I wouldn't trust some don't feel right. All good. Something. Sometimes things are just too good to be true. All right, this shouldn't be too tough. Well, I'll be damned. Mama's gonna be thrilled to see that old swing all fixed up. Hopefully, our kids will like it too. Did you say something, darling? Oh, my goodness. Did you do that? Just trying to help out a bit around here. You know, I used to push Andy and his brother out here on that swing every night when they were kids. Seems like such a long time ago now. Yeah, it does. Nah, bro, it's too good to be true, bro. Listen, man, all's all's not always good in paradise, bro. Mm hmm What you know, Andy? Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? No. We've scraped together a good supply in the last few months. How about yourselves? What kind of protection do you have around here? We collected a few guns to protect ourselves, but we really only use them when we go off the property. When we're inside the perimeter, the fence is all we need to keep us safe. Mm. We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but Ultimately, they moved on. No, nah, they did the in that. People they lost yeah. contact with. No, nah, we're good. An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers? Walkers? <laughs> is that what you call them? <laughs> That's good. Uh, the old one wouldn't have, but Mac, he was our foreman. He figured out how to amp it up with the generators. We used to sit out here some nights and watch Yo, the what if they eat people? And pop when they got too close. Closest thing to anything. Because they got abundance of food, bro. These like, generators are talking about the cannibalism. But they can't be eating lots, people. Gotta keep it's too risky. Fuel, Remember much they much said if they chop the brain off. They all work together um, to do the trick. Like us. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but gets overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. Oh my gosh, Mark is gonna die. Because <sighs> he didn't give the, the rifle to Carly. You can't trust nobody in these streets. Probably should never went. Dang it. You hear that music? It's about to go so down. How's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay? If no, we can? bro. It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. He wouldn't be such a pain in the ass if you weren't telling him we were talking behind his back all the time. I, I'm, I'm sorry. All right. I try to be civil at least. He's too busy being cranky to notice. <laughs> oh, oh. There's one. Ugh. Lee, it's dead. Come on, let's push it off. I don't think he did. Andy said when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. Now, oh, what's up with this arrow? Maybe the St. John boys are using this guy for target practice? Ah, poor guy. I don't know what got him first, the arrow or the fence. Either way, hope he was already dead. 
Who do you think he was? Maybe a farmhand. I don't know. I hope he wasn't like this long before the fence finished him off. Yeah. Disgusting. Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is nah, keep in mind that this arrow. Be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? There's a guy that just died had a yep. crossbow. The fortress needs people to defend it. We've got enough people. So what's your take on the brothers? I'm they seem to have this place tied down pretty well. What do you mean by that? I don't know. They seem decent enough. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. That's all. Thanks. There's another one. I see it. Mm -mm. Man. Man, the fence burnt right into its hands. I think they fused together. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Christ. I can't stop thinking about dinner. I don't, think, been those, nice to get I don't think those are walkers. I think those are people grabbing too, onto you know? it trying to get some help. Mm -hmm. I'm hungry too, Mark. Do you think they're going to be good for it? Dinner for a whole group of people? If they've got as much food as they say, I, I think so. Dang. Come on. I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> Little help here, Lee? If you're waiting for that guy to help, it ain't gonna happen. Come on. Bro, somebody about to pop out. Holy fuck! What just Ooh. happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows Ooh. we're out here. Ah. Oh. Oh. What the? Get to the gate. Get down! You asshole! Jesus! We had an agreement! Now you're fucked! Who the fuck is that? No idea! Fuck! Now what? With a fence Ooh. on that gate, it's our only way out! You got lucky that time! Come on out! I already got one of you! Lee, hurry up! The are stuck in the dirt! the gate. We can get through get this fence and back to the house. Ah! You shit the ah. Oh my gosh, bro. This so, is crazy. But you know what? You hear them saying it? We had an agreement. Yeah. I already got one of you. <gasps> the high school. What happened? Shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. Gonna have to move it. Over there. I see him. Yeah, we'll take what we want. Yeah, bro. I told you it's too good to be true, bro. Yeah. So what did they what did they do? Another one. 
another one. Ah, another one? How many of those you things really can be pushed think down? You fuck with us? You didn't deliver the goods. Now we're gonna take what's going Was I supposed to kill him? You didn't deliver the food. That didn't make no freaking no, sense. Alright, uh, How many whatever. of those things did, did we push really down? Did you think you can fuck with us? I think you were supposed to use the stick to get away. Ah, fuck you, fuck you, bitch! Uh, 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 Behind the tractor! Uh, 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 give you. us the food! Alright! Get, get out of the way! What was I supposed to use? You okay? Yeah. Uh, barely. Shit. Come on. The gate's right there. Damn. What about our arrangement? Where's our food, you asshole? Oh, there you go. Get away. Let's get out of here. You lucky sons of bitches. Go ahead and run. We ain't going nowhere. Yup, too good to be true. So what y'all do to piss these people off? Lee, what's wrong? Uh, 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 there was a goddamn ambush out there. Holy shit, are, are you okay? The bandits here? On our property? Oh my lord, what happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah. I'll be all right once it's out, but god damn it hurts. Hey, y'all. Mark, oh my oh god, no. what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just pull it out. Oh no, honey, come on, Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, nah, bro, we gotta address what that. What kind of shit is this? We Why ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhand. Nah. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. What you do about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. <sighs> so much for your deal. Those shitheads broke the agreement. Look, I'm sorry, Lee. If I had any inkling they were gonna give you guys trouble, well, we would have gone out there with you. No. Nah. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I, I think I like know Charlie where at least Sheen. one of their camps are. Yeah. <laughs> when you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Nah, Can't scoping out serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's ben Can we Carly? sacrifice Since Larry? Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Hey, kids, look what Lee got working for you. A swing. I nah, love why swings. they bring the kids in this? Like my tree house. Nah, Come they on, trying to win us over to protect Thanks. them from the bandits. Yeah. You're the best. Yeah. Yep. Because they, he was asking how many people y'all got over there. Yep, they want us to fight the bandits off for them. 
Who turned the generator on? Right. Why duck the first one on it? Well, it's Kenny, though. I gotta, I, I'll let it slide. Hey, Clem, do you like the swing? Yeah, it's fun. <laughs> Thanks for fixing it. You're welcome. Will you push me on it? Sure. Happy to push you on the swing. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. Yes, sir. What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? No. Not sure. I'm not sure, Clem. I hope so. I hope so, too. How are you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? We got lucky out there. It would have been a lot worse. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Well, we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. Oh. I want you to stay lucky, too. Ever yep. since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. Don't worry. We're safe here now. As long as the bad people don't get me, too, right? I won't let what happened to Mark. We ain't let nobody touch you, gay. I promise. Flimmy Wimmy. All right, Clem. That's enough for now. Okay. Thanks for pushing me. Of course. It's all yours. Yeah. Okay, Duck. Don't pop a gasket. They look happy. Okay. I gotta talk to Kenny. Where are you going? Talk to Kenny. Hey. Hey, Lee. Found anything interesting? I was talking to Andy a bit earlier. Doesn't sound like they have too many guns around. They rely mostly on the fence to keep them safe. So long as you're on this side, things are all right. Provided the fence holds out. Well, that's the problem. When there's no more gas, there's no more fence. That's true. Well, it's good to know what we're working mm. with here. Keep looking around. And let me know if you find anything else. You gotta get into that barn. How you holding up? I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. On the way over here, I was getting dizzy. Hands shaking, cold sweats. Thought I was gonna pass out. They've got food here. Yeah, but I'm not just talking about one meal, you know? Did Duck and Katja get here okay? Well, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this place. Well, if everything works out, maybe he and Katja good thing I fed him. your life here. I hope you're right. Duck and Clementine deserve a better life than starving to death at some crappy motel. I guess uh, Lily isn't too thrilled about being here. I could give two shits about what Lily wants. Duck and Katja need food, and I'm not about to sit around that motor inn and watch them go hungry. You're with me on this, right? <sighs> yeah. Yeah, of course. Lily's judgment is clouded, but you got a pretty clear head about these things. I'm gonna go have a look around. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. But if he had to, if he says kill them and take the farm, I don't know about, the about that. Johns and their relationship with those bandits or whatever. Yeah. Right. I'll see what I can find out. If he says kill them and take the farm, I can't jack with that. Ain't jack with that. Unless they, we find out more. What what's it? going on? What was it saying to pick up? Oh, use the, the gate. Yeah. Uh, because they tweaking. We can't trust nothing that they say or do. They're storing gasoline all over the property. Yeah. Doesn't look very safe, but I guess that's the point. That thing keeps a fence electrified. Oh, yes. Y'all did something. Y'all tried to kill us or something. I guess Mark and I were lucky we weren't touching this thing when it came on. Now they back there. You can't even go to the barn. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I can go in here now. 
I gotta tell Lily that we can't. I, I mean, I'm not really rooting for Lily, but she's not wrong. She's not wrong. Lots of hay. Hmm. Enough of these might work as adequate cover from arrows if that becomes a problem. She's not wrong with how she feels, but she's also she's letting the power. She's power tripping. Looks like a feeding station for the cow. Yeah. What else over here? Who is that? Oh. Freaking Larry. Lee, oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? He'll be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. Shut up! How could you all bring us to this place? How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. I don't know. If we'd just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. She's right. I take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything. But gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid if you ask me. Mm. Lee. I know you and Kenny are friends, but you recognize that he's not the right person to lead this group, don't you? You don't have to say anything. Your actions at the motel pretty much say it all. And not giving my dad food. That was cold. Man! Man, forget your daddy! I don't care about this old dude. He tried to kill me. You know what, bro? You know how I feel? You know how I feel? Y'all better hope this raid don't happen. Because y'all not making it. Having a crop like that on hand must be great. We're going to need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. Mm, what's that, corn? Why, we, why is she trying to act like your dad didn't just try to kill me? Right. If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. If there's not enough room, I can't in the open house the barn door. Us, there, bro, I'm telling you, there's dead people in there. Camp bro. out here in shifts. Bro, forget your daddy. <laughs> you better hope your daddy and me don't have a life. Trust me, if it's a save Larry or save Kenny, oh, I'm sorry, gang. Larry's not in my definitions of people living to like save. Larry. We not finna be living like Larry. Larry finna be deceased. I don't give a crap about Larry. Don't talk to them people up there. Yeah, and I know y'all next, cause I know something wrong with y'all. He ain't got no eyeball. Oh. Fellas. Uh uh, what was that? How you feeling, I think it was a glitch. Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, Save lots. nutty as all hell and getting mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Not now. Yeah, it'll be a good opportunity to find out oh, a bit I more about what we're up against. My Let's fault. do it. I pressed the wrong I'll button. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. I pressed the wrong button. 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 We're cooked. Are you going now? We're done. Yeah. I'll be back soon, Clementine. We're done. Please be lucky. I will. Yeah, okay. We're done. And why is he not coming with us? I got the toolie. It's okay. I got a toolie. See anything? Not yet. Oh my gosh. I know it's around here. It's got to be close. Soup. 
here. Oh shit, you found it? lacking out here you see anybody stay on your guard watch my back Lee I'm gonna check out the tent If I let this brother die, it's over. Yeah. Clear. This camp's too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. They got kids in there, though. Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these recently. Empty. But it looks like someone's oh. been eating. Why does it say can look at cans recently. and look at bottles, but then they're right. two different things? Nah, somebody was over here cooking. Yep. Yeah. Just water. Nothing. Yes, over there. Empty. I need some potato chips. Mm, mm, mm. Save lots. Got What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? This is too much stuff for just one person. Trust me, these selfish bastards don't stop taking. Probably just to remind us that it's theirs. St. John's Dairy. Nah. Nah, there's something up with these people, bro. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. Dang. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. Let me watch him, bro. Mm -hmm. Looks like they expected to be here a while. Tent looks pretty new. Anybody inside? Two sleeping bags. One of them's kid sized. Mm. Uh, nah, I think, you know what? I, I don't think that's their farm. I think I they think took over. What do you yeah. find? Video camera. Let me see that. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get it's a It's not on. their farm. It's not their farm. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. <sighs> nah. Yep, he they I don't think that's their farm. Nope. Either either it's not their farm or they they killed everybody and took that mug. So, it's clips. It's clips. Hold on, look at gas can camera. What you doing? Nothing but fuels. 
Shit. Put your guns down. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as That's long Clementine's as we gave you food. What the I'm fuck happened? Someone she had. You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are, and I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. We had a deal. You people broke it first. Why are you alone up here? What happened to you? Well, that's a hell of a question, mister. They told me I'd be safe with them. Men who lived here. But it weren't safe. Not for me. And not for my girl. They didn't treat her nice. Not at all. They took her away into the woods. Wouldn't tell me where. And I begged them every way I could think. They just laughed. <laughs> so I killed them. And I'm staying here till she comes back to me. One way or another. She'll come back. Now maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down! You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice sharp arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Oh, take man. a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? A little girl. You stole it from her! So what if I did? You stole her from me! Huh? What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, uh right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'ma head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. Put down the crossbow. No, sir, I need it. I need it to kill you fuckers. <laughs> Go on. Tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind for us. God damn it! You straight up murdered that woman. Hardly. Oh. She had a crossbow pointed at my forehead. She was about to expose him, that's why. Nah, something ain't right. It's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Oh, they're crooked. Mm. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. You're back! What happened? Handled it, Mama. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. 
Then screw it up for everybody mm -hmm. then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. It's happening. Are we back? They have different ideas about how we should run our group. If they don't find any common ground, this whole thing's gonna fall apart. No, it's just tough times. Everyone's hungry and people get a little stir crazy when their tummy's empty. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. I'm mad Carly stayed. Yeah, she my ace. She be shooting. Alright, y'all. That's a good point to stop. We've been recording for a long time. We the story's make, getting good. The story is getting really good, y'all. It's getting extremely good. Alright, guys. We're gonna end it off here. Hey, get these likes up, please. The likes do help us with the algorithm. Share it with your friends, watch it on your phone, watch it twice, do whatever you gotta do. But uh, we'll talk to you guys. Hopefully we got some other videos we gotta do. But if you guys like this, if this video can get 100 likes, we'll drop the next episode as soon as we can. All right? All right, y'all, peace. Bye.